Chapter 4 A Thief in Town The next day, the thieves go back to the cave. Where's the dead body? They ask. A friend of his knows about our treasure cave and has the body. Ashard, their chief, says. We must find him at once. Go into town. Ashard tells Najid, one of the thieves. Perhaps you can learn something about the dead man there. In town, Najid visits the cobbler's shop. Baba Mustafa is speaking to a friend. So, she puts a blindfold on me, and we go to a house, and I sew up a dead body in four pieces there, he says. Najid gives two gold coins to the cobbler. Take me to the dead man's house, he says. Baba Mustafa is clever. He closes his eyes and remembers his steps. In the end, they arrive at Ali Baba's house. Here we are. The cobbler says. Najid puts a white mark on the door. I must tell Ashad about this, he thinks, and he leaves. Baba Mustafa walks slowly back to his shop. Soon after that, Morjana comes out. She sees the mark on Ali Baba's door. Hmm. Somebody wants to mark our house, she thinks. Perhaps it's the thieves. What shall I do? Chapter 5 The Chief Arrives Morjana marks every door in the street. When Ashad arrives, he can't find Ali Baba's house. He visits the cobbler's shop and gives three gold coins to Baba Mustafa. The cobbler takes him to Ali Baba's house. Ashad looks carefully at it. He doesn't mark it. Morjana is watching through the window. Later, Ashad comes back in different clothes. He knocks on Ali Baba's door. I'm an oil merchant. I'm taking my oil to a town far away. Can I sleep here tonight? He says. Ali Baba is a good man. Of course, he answers. Leave your oil jars behind my house and come in. Ashad leaves the 40 jars behind the house. One jar has oil in, but there are thieves in 39 of the jars. When I knock on the jars... Ashard tells his men quietly. Come out 
and kill Ali Baba. Then he goes into the house. Later, Mojana visits the jars. She needs oil for her lamp. Is it time? The thieves ask. No, wait! She answers. She puts hot oil in the jars, and the thieves die suddenly. When Ashad comes and knocks on the jars, nobody answers him. Hey, my men are all dead. He cries. He leaves very quickly. Chapter 6 Clever Morjana Some weeks later, Ashad comes back to town. Now he's wearing the clothes of a rich gold merchant. Ashad opens a new shop. Ali Baba's son, Murad, has Kasim's old shop across the street. Ashad and Murad are soon friends. Father, can my new friend come for dinner? Murad asks Ali Baba one day. Of course, Ali Baba says. Ali Baba doesn't recognize Ashad when he comes to the house for dinner. But when clever Mojana brings the dinner, she recognizes him at once. After dinner, Mojana dances for them. Suddenly, Ashad attacks Ali Baba with a knife. Mojana quickly attacks Ashad, and she kills him. After that, she explains everything. Morjana, you're the cleverest servant in all Persia, Ali Baba says. You must marry Murad, and have some treasure too. Thank you, Father, Morad and Morjana say. The two of them marry, and they move into the next house in the street. In time, they have many children, and they live there very happily for many years. <laughs>